Hello, welcome to my linear algebra series about matrices and matrix math. This is the first episode. I'm going to go over some basic concepts and just some things you'll need to know. I'm going to be using this GIMP image editor as my little uh, chalkboard type area so that way I can uh, modify things as needed. So to get into the basic concepts I'm basically just going to teach you what a matrix is today. And uh, let's see here. We're going to create, I guess I'll just do a new image, leave that old one there. So the most basics of a matrix is a matrix is a rectangular array of elements arranged in horizontal rows and vertical columns. So you'll see it often represented something like this. Some large brackets and then some elements within. Like uh, maybe we'll have a two, a three, four, we'll just put some random things here, a two, a seven, an eight, a nine, a six, and a four. And you'll often see it represented with some sort of capital letter and an equals. So this would be a matrix A, which is size three by three. And uh, the columns are often represented by the letter J and the rows are often represented by the letter I. So this here being the first element would be A11. So you'll see that as, uh, let's see here, where do I have space, I'm out of space. So if you see something like this, A11, whoop, a11 equals, and you're trying to find the answer, you go over here and you look for into the matrix A in the area 1, 1, which is I1, J1, and it's 2. And there you go. So if you change this up a little bit and you say, I don't know, what is A34? Oh, that doesn't exist because there is no 4. So what is A32? A32 would be, well, you go to the three on the row, you always go to the row first, the row's always first, which would be here, because this is first one, second one, third one, and then you want to go to the two on the column, so that would be to here. So this would be a three, two, and the answer would be eight. So that's some basic notation there of how to access them. And Usually it looks something like this and you know it's a matrix. Sometimes people put brackets around it to syntax that. But it's kind of however you want to do it in that case. And a few more basic things to mention that are important. Uh, let's see here. The elements that have an equal i and j, like this one here, the, the 2 being a 1, 1, 7 being at location 2, 2, four being a location three three are said to be diagonal. So let's see, am I missing anything else here? Oh yeah, these elements within, they don't necessarily have to be numbers. They can be anything. Like this could just be an x squared or it could be some other formula or function as the element. A matrix itself, itself is not a number. So you can't say an entire matrix is equal to some specific number like you can with a lot of other things. I think that covers all the very basics and we'll go further in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check the links below for more ways to support this channel. And we'll see you in the next episode. Peace out.